In this tutorial, we'll see what is Ansible Collections and how to install collections manually. Ansible Collections are the bundles of automation content, including playbooks, roles, modules, and plugins. One example for collection is Cisco IOS that mainly contains modules for configuring Cisco IOS devices. Previously, we have used many modules from this collection. We have used uh, Cisco IOS interfaces, L2 interfaces, L3 interfaces, static routes, etc. That collection was part of community edition. So we don't have to install it manually. Roles also can be part of collections, but it is not mandatory to have roles inside collections. You can distribute roles either within collections or as an independent role that we'll see later. For roles also, we have Ansible Galaxy role command for initializing or installing it that we'll see later. Collections allow you to easily distribute content in a standardized format. We have seen Cisco IOS collections and they are distributed via Ansible Galaxy or repositories. There are multiple installation methods. You can use Ansible Galaxy command and if it is available in the Galaxy, we can just give the namespace and collection name. It will automatically install. Or you can even give requirements file and within requirements file you can give even the github repository for installing collection and by default ansible installs collections in home dot ansible collections directory so we'll create a separate virtual environment with only ansible core package and try to install cisco ios collection manually here this is galaxy home page here we can see help other Ansible users by sharing the awesome roles and collections you created. Even we can create and distribute it to Ansible Galaxy. Here I'll be showing how to download one collection. I'll go to search. Here I'll search for iOS. And you can see here this particular collection is provided by Cisco. This is the namespace and this is the collection name I'll click on iOS and if you go to Cisco we'll be able to see a lot of collections for different different device types I'll open iOS they'll be frequently updating the collections you can see here the latest version is 6.1.1 this updated three days ago and you can see the download for installing this from the galaxy we can give this command even we can download the tar file from here and install it manually i'll go to the documentation of this collections here we'll be able to see the module list the plugins available within this and if you go to dependencies, we'll be able to see the dependency for this particular collection. Now I'll click on repo and this will be redirecting to GitHub page of this particular collection. And here if you click on the tags, here also we can see the latest version. It is 6.1.1. This got updated three days ago. We'll see how to install it from GitHub and Ansible Galaxy. Now I'll go to VS Code. Previously we were using VENV1. I'll open that source home slash. And here I have installed Ansible Community Edition. So we have all the community packages available. Here I'll give Ansible hyphen Galaxy collection list. And here we already have Cisco iOS collection available. So previously I have installed it using pip install. Ansible. If you give this command, this will be installing community edition of Ansible. Now, what we'll do, we will 
deactivate this particular virtual environment and we'll create a new environment and go to the home directory here i already have a virtual environment i'll just delete that directory now i'll create a virtual environment here the command to create virtual environment is virtual env hyphen p python 3.10 is there here in the home directory i'll call collection demo now we have virtual environment created i'll give source collection demo bin activate i'll give pip list here so we have very minimal package available here i'll install only ansible core this will be installing minimum required packages for ansible now here we'll give the command ansible collection list and you can see here we don't have any collections now and by default this will be looking in the ansible collections directory you can verify that as well i'll give ls home slash dot ansible currently we don't have collections directory available here now if you want to see total number of modules available within this ansible installation you can give ansible hyphen doc hyphen l and you can see we have only ansible built-ins available here if you want to see the count of this we can give five word count and we have 71 modules available here now we'll try to install cisco ios collections i'll go to the documentation i'll go to install copy this command i'll run this command here so now this is downloading from galaxy and installing it in the machine you can see the version this has installed this is installing the latest version and now we'll try executing this command now the total number of modules has increased and we'll check even home slash dot ansible here now we have a collections directory and inside that we have all these installed you can see even this has installed the dependency in this way you can install using ansible galaxy collection install command now we'll see how to install it using requirements file here i'll be using this particular directory here i'll create a file requirements dot yaml within this file i'll create collections and name i'll give cisco dot ios and we can give version this is optional i'll give 6.1.1 save it and before that we'll remove the previous file i'll give rm hyphen rf home slash dot ansible slash collections 
now we'll try running the collections list command again ansible galaxy collection list now this is not showing any collections now to install it using requirements file we need to give ansible galaxy collection install hyphen r then i'll give the directory requirements dot yaml now this is reading this requirements file and installing the collections now we can verify the collections again i'll give ansible galaxy collection list now we have these collections available i'll delete this again and now we'll see how to install it from github i will comment this here i'll give name we need to give the github repository then we need to give the type as git then version we need to give this tag version it is v6.1.1 v6.1.1 save it Now we'll try running this again. Now this is downloading the file from GitHub repository and installing it. Now we'll execute the collection list. So we're getting same collection again. I'll remove it again. Now we'll see how to install it from the tar file. So first we need to download the tar file. We need to keep it in any location. I'll download and keep it in this particular directory 19 collections role. So that I'll go to the Ubuntu machine, which I'm accessing from here. click on click on download tar file and we'll go to home and civil master class and i'll select the directory it is 19 save it now we have file available here now i'll comment this Here I'll give name and we need to give the name of this file. We need to give type file. Save it and we'll try running this. So it is saying unable to find collection because i am running this from this directory so either i can give the full directory of the file here or i can go to 19 collections and roles here i'll give in this format so now this is trying to install the collections from 
the tar file now we'll give collection list command again so now also we have the collection available i'll delete this again now if you want to install this from github using ansible galaxy command we can give ansible galaxy then collection install please git plus and we need to give the github repository i'll copy paste it here then comma we need to give the version version v6.1.1 enter so now also this will be downloading from github so this time we are not using requirements file we are directly downloading from github using ansible galaxy command now also we have the collection available here now if you want to download the file here we have even ansible galaxy command ansible galaxy collection download sco.us so now this will download the file here it is downloading all these files i already had this file even if you delete it it will automatically download the file here and you will be able to see all the dependencies and requirements here in all these ways you can install ansible collections i hope now you have clear understanding on how to install Ansible collections.